Okay guys, so this is the overview of my desk. My desk and my chair are both from Ikea. That's my chair. I'll link them down below in the description. The containers that I use to hold my brushes and as, as well as the sand that they're in, both from the Dollar Tree, as well as these containers that I use for like organizing the stuff in my drawers. So first I'm going to show you all my face palettes. I already opened everything so it would be easier. Kit. I think it's called Sculpture Kit. Yeah, it smells like hot cocoa. It's, I love it so much. And then these are, this is a glow kit from Pure Cosmetics. And this is a sculpt. These both came together. And then this uh, bronze and brighten Pure Cosmetics palette. Yeah, the really highlighter in this. Then this Anastasia glow kit. The Kat Von D shade and light palette. This is the old packaging. I really love this. This e.l.f. blush in the shade Tickled Pink. This Wet n Wild uh, highlighter in the shade Precious Petals. This Tarte Bronzer. Um, Becca blush in the shade Songbird. Sample of Mary Luminizer from Bomb Cosmetics. For the most part, I keep from my foundations and concealer and primer in their own like little tube. And then I have this Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder. This is a really good powder. Okay, so the Tarte Double Duty Beauty Foundation. This is the matte version. The Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. Maybelline Dewy and Smooth Sample of this Makeup Forever HD Foundation. NYX Concealer. Dr. Brandt Luminizer Primer. This Cover FX Blurring Primer. The Becca Backlight Priming Filter. This is my all-time favorite primer, Too Faced Hangover Primer. This e.l.f. Under Eye Primer. It's hydrating under eye primer. And this uh, primer, I got this in Ipsy. I'm not sure if it's Haley's, Halsey's. Who knows, but it's a nice primer. And then this sample of the MAC Strobe Cream. Okay, so I'm going to do my lip stuff now. And I just have everything kind of like piled in here. And I don't use all of this, so I'm going to, like, dump it out and organize, like, what I'm going to declutter and, like, what I'm going to keep because, you know, yeah. And then I'll show y'all, like, in depth what So everything. this is all the stuff that I'm not keeping. First, these e.l.f. lip crowns. This is natural. This is what shade is this? Wine Red and Malberry Maven. I just don't wear these anymore, so I'm going to give them to probably one of my sister's. Then, like, I have a whole bunch of red lipsticks because I don't wear red lipsticks, so I think it's pointless for me to hold on to these. This is a Smashbox one, and that's an e.l.f. one. These NYX lipsticks. I got these in a kit. I'll link it down below because I did a whole video of me swatching them. These are just the shades I would never wear, so I'm going to be giving them away. This Tarte sample size of one of their lip paints. I'm giving, um cluttering that probably going to give it to one of my sisters this is broken so i think i'm just going to throw it away even though it's really Paris pretty lipstick um what brand is this pretty vulgar metallic i don't wear metallics this i don't remember what brand but it's from boxy charms it's just a shade i would never wear this revlon lipstick definitely expired another elf red lipstick l'oreal paris lip gloss that is definitely expired so these can just go in the trash because they're expired. This NYX um, lipstick. It's just a shade that I don't really wear anymore. So, yeah. This is just all the stuff that I'm not keeping. And this e.l.f. lip liner. Yeah. I'm not keeping oh, for the stuff it. that I am keeping. So, I have uh, these four NYX. Um, I think they're they're the soft matte lip creams. The, these are from the kit that I was just talking about. It was a vault. I don't know why I call it a kit. But I'm keeping these because these are the shades that I like and I would wear. Even though I really wouldn't wear this one, it's just I like it, so I'm going to keep it. Then these NYX. Um, some of these are butter glosses. This is a butter gloss. Is my camera going to focus? It's okay. butter gloss. I really like this shade. Then I have this uh, Real Her Girl Power like sample size of this mauve lips lipstick. It's in the shade mauve. This liquid lipstick from the brand, I'm assuming is Caked, that's the brand, but I got this in Ipsy, and yeah, the shade's not on it. This Revlon Matte, this is so old, but like, I still love it, and it smells so good. This is a red lipstick that I am keeping, it's from the brand Tease Cosmetics, it's just a red lipstick. 
even though I don't wear red, I feel like if I wanted to wear red, this would be my red. So that's why I'm keeping it. And plus, I love the packaging. It's like so cute. This liquid lipstick got this in Boxy Charms. This lip crown. Um, hey Honey. Um, Shea Butter Lip Balm. This lip treatment. This Pure Cosmetics Lip Exfoliator. This Real Her Lip Liner in the shade I Love Myself. This, uh, yep, Galactic Beauty Liquid Lipstick. This smells so good. It smells like vanilla. I love it. This lip gloss that I just recently got in BoxyCharms. This lip liner from the brand, I think, yep, Contour. I think that's the brand. I'm not sure, but yeah. Uh, this e.l.f. lip liner. It's a red lip liner just because if I ever wear red, you know, I have a red lip liner. And then this... This is actually not even really a lip. Okay, so for the majority of my eye stuff, besides like my eyeshadow palettes, I keep it in like all the same container. And then I just have my eyelashes like all back here. But yeah, I'm just going to get into this. There is some stuff I'm going to declutter just because like I don't use it. So I'm going to like divide the stuff I show you into declutter. Okay, and so this stuff is the stuff I'm decluttering. I'm really not decluttering much. But it, it's something. First, this eyebrow stain. I got this from Wish. I was going to do a video on it, but I never did. So, yeah, it's pointless. This Naked Cosmetics Loose Eyeshadow. It's really pretty, but it's just like a shade that I wouldn't use. As well as this. Like, all of these are... These... Oh, my God. These. This is so freaking pretty. It's just I would never really wear this shade. But it's, like, so pigmented. As well as this. And this and this is just old so i can be thrown away and this wet and wild mascara i've never used it so i'm probably going to give it to one of my sisters and this can be thrown away just because i've had it forever so it's definitely expired now for the stuff that i'm keeping these sharpeners these are elf cosmetics sharpener oh yeah there it says this luna cosmetics eyeshadow it's a really beautiful shade this uh, Pretty Vulgar, I'm pretty sure it's spring. Yep, Pretty Vulgar Gel Liner. These two NYX Glitters. This e.l.f. Um, I think it's called Lock On Liner and Brow Cream. It's in the shade Light Brown. I'm actually giving this away in my giveaway once I hit 500 subscribers. Not like this specific one, but you get what I'm saying. This Anastasia Brow Pomade. It's in the shade Medium Brown, which is not my shade, but I'm still keeping it. Because I still do make it work. Douche Mascara, Urban Decay Eyeliner, NYX Glitter Primer, Vintage Cosmetic Eyeliner, Dual Eyelash Glue, Tarte Mascara, Elf Eyeliner, Elf Mascara, another Elf Mascara. Just a whole bunch of mascaras. This NYX um, Eye Crown in the shade Milk, Elf Mascara. This Eyebrow Stuff, I don't even know what the brand is. Oh. The Brow Gal. That's what that is. Some eyeliner. This is from the brand Bare Minerals. It's a brown eyeliner. This is from the brand Seraphine. I can't pronounce it. <laughs> this Cover FX Shimmerville. It Cosmetics Brow Pencil. LA Colors Eyeliner. This C8 London Eyeliner. NYX, I, actually I'm going to get rid of that just because I wouldn't use that shade. This uh, Benefit sample size of the Real, the Real Mascara. And then some more eyeliner and a mascara sample from IT Cosmetics. That's probably expired but I love it so much so I'm keeping it. I'll show you all my lashes. I have a lot of these from Juna & Co. These lashes that you see in the Lollipop packaging, these are literally only a dollar. And they're all uh, different numbers, so they're all, like, different. And then the Ardell Wispies. I really wish I would have got the Demi Wispies, but these are still really good, too. And those are the only eyelashes. Okay, so now for the palettes, I literally have a video on almost all of these of, like, me swatching them. But at first, I'm going to show you all this one. It is from the brand Crown Cosmetics, but I don't use it, so I'm going to give it to one of my sister's. It's not a bad palette, it's just it's not my cup of tea. The Morphe Ready Set Gold palette. I have a video of me swatching this palette. I'll link it down below if you want to see that. Jaclyn Hill palette. I also have a 
video of me swatching it. I'll link that down below. And as well as these two Morphe palettes. This is the Night Slayer. Wait, no, I think it's the Night Master and then the Day Slayer. I have a video of me swatching both of these. And I'm pre it was their holiday collection, but I'm pretty sure they made it like permanent. These, they're my favorite palettes. So, yeah. And then this Tarte Tartlet palette. I don't even really like this, but it was my first high-end palette that I ever purchased. So, I'm keeping it. Winky Luxe Kitten palette. I like this. I really love this holographic shade. That's the name of the shade. And then this uh, Pure Cosmetics. Yep. Eyeshadow palette that I got in BoxyCharms. This ColourPop palette. I have a brand new one of these. That I got in Boxy Charms that I'm going to be giving away. And I also have a swatching video that will be linked down below. Now the last part for my makeup brushes. Majority of them, I keep them in the cup. But it's like it's been overfilling. So I think I'm going to move my Mermaid Tail ones into here. If you saw some sponges in the intro that are not in here. It's because I decluttered a lot of stuff and I lost the footage. But I'm going to declutter this as well. It's a black head sucking thing from Wish. I was going to do a video on it but I never got around to it. And these eyeliner stencils, I never use them, so yeah, I'm going to declutter those. And then this is just the eye makeup remover, Clean Sweep, Juno & Co sponge, Mermaid Tail brushes. I did a whole video on these, and then there's some tweezers. But I'm moving these in here just because they take up so much space in here. And I'm going to declutter this one just because I'm not into fan brushes anymore. Um, and I'm going to declutter these. These are all from TJ Maxx. I got them in a kit. And then for the rest of my brushes, it's just Real Techniques, Elf, Crown, Luxie, Equal Tools. Uh, and that's Real Technique as well. And then this one is, we just got it in Boxy Charms. And the same with my eyeshadow brushes, Real Techniques, Equal Tools, Luxie, random ones from Ipsy, Elf, Wet n Wild, some Eco Tools, and some from Boxy Charms. I forget, the Vintage Cosmetics. Yeah, and then this is my favorite highlighting brush, which I'm giving away. So, yeah, that's it for my makeup collection, but I'm about to show y'all what I'm going to be giving away. So, stay tuned if you want to see that. This is everything I'm giving away. First is ColourPop Golden State of Mind Palette. I have a video of me watching that. It's brand new from BoxyCharms. Elf Lock On Liner and Brow Cream. A brand new Juno Co sponge. Pretty vulgar blush that I never even swatched. SL Miss Glam Highlighting Brush this is one of my favorite highlighting brushes, because and this one's brand new. Uh, body Lotion, Tarte Powder, and an Ipsy bag that is just really cute. Yeah, so if you want to win this, make sure you're subscribed. I will be giving all of this away once I hit 500 subscribers. <laughs>